Just uh, another angle for the couple trees I'm gonna I'm planning on taking down next spring. Make a little bit more room. Take you back to my wood lot a little bit. No, wood not wood lot, but my lumber piles. This is cottonwood and spruce mixed, mostly spruce. And that's all spruce. And that is all cottonwood, other than some boards, some timbers I had on the, that were left on the property when I bought it. Most of this is 12 foot long. Most of this is 10 foot long. <clears throat> Shows you how much snow we've gotten so far this year. Uh, just about a just about a foot of snow. Not quite. I haven't got a tape out and measured it, but That is going to be my sawmill shed. And then this pile back here, these two piles of birch. Well, birch. I will use on the inside of the cabin. And I'd like to make a couple picnic tables for some friends that have donated wood to me. I need a tree cleared out, I go get it. And I'd like to do that. Not sure if or when I'll be able to ever do it, but that's what I would like to do. From this angle, you can see a little bit better some of the pile of trees I have to cut up. This is more, mostly 10, 10 to 8 to 10 foot long logs. And then over here, my logs are 12 foot long. See if I can get a better view of that. My junk pile. Uh, that's that's a nice little uh, spruce tree. It's 18 inches across the butt end and 14 inches across the other end. So I should get some some good uh, wood out of that. down to this end and it's just another glimpse so those three logs right there came out off of one tree cottonwood right there I have a couple nice birch logs in here And some small birch just the tops of stuff that I had to cut down and uh, those will make okay maybe trim boards or something <laughs> 